You want to come up here? Yeah. Okay. Hi, I'm Lindsay Costa, I'm nutrigenomics counselor and health coach. I have a visitor today. This is Dahlia. You want to say hi? Hi. Hi. And uh, I want to just talk about weight and weight gain. Is it genetic? Is it environmental? Well, they've done identical twin studies to be able to, to look at this where twins have exact same DNA as the others. And they see that environment definitely plays a role, but genetics has a huge component and it will be able to tell you how high one's appetite is likely to be, how they burn calories, how fast they burn fat, how they store fat, and um, also how resistant to weight loss they are. There's also another thing that we don't need a genetic test to tell us, but uh, if exercise or diet is likely to play a larger role in weight loss, sometimes we don't need genetics to tell us that. But the other things are really helpful to, to know if um, how our genes are impacting our weight. That is the weight and energy section of the report, but there's another more upstream, more root cause approach, which is actually related to, for example, how well one detoxifies. If they don't detoxify well, then they will not likely be able to lose weight no matter how, um, how their genes look from a weight and energy perspective. So fixing the root cause upstream will be able to better manage weight. So if you've got any questions, don't hesitate to comment below. And if you like these videos, like or subscribe, please. Thank you so much for watching and health up everyone. See you, bye-bye. Goodbye.